Hi welcome back in this video I'm going to talk about 10 iPhone battery saving tips. First enable optimized battery charging. Go to settings. Scroll down to battery. Tap on battery health. And enable optimized battery charging. Optimized battery charging helps slow the rate of battery aging by reducing the time your iPhone spends fully charged. iPhone learns from your daily charging routine so it can wait to finish charging past 80% until you need to use it. This will improve your battery life. Next turn off unnecessary location services. To do that go to privacy. Tap Location Services. Turn off any apps that you don't think are necessary to be tracking your location at all times. For example Facebook doesn't need your location to be set as always as this will use your location all times and drain your iPhone battery. Look for any apps that are using your location always and change it. If you don't want app to track at all you can change access to never. This will help your battery life. Next go to system services. Most of them drains your iPhone's battery life and if you turn them off these system services will not affect your overall usage. Leave on emergency calls and SOS. Find my iPhone and networking and wireless. You can turn off rest of them as they drains your iPhone's battery. Next go to significant locations, turn off significant locations, press turn off. Significant locations keep track of places you have recently been, as well as how often and when you visited them. This uses GPS all times and drain your iPhone battery. Next go to product improvement. Turn off all product improvement. Product improvement sends data about your use of GPS features to Apple to help improve those features. Next turn off share iPhone analytics which drains your iPhone battery. To do that go back to privacy setting. Scroll down to analytics and improvement. Turn off Share iPhone Analytics. iPhone Analytics sends data from your iPhone to Apple which drains your battery and could present a privacy issue about how you use your phones. Although the data sent is de-identified this is an unnecessary feature if you are already having battery performance issues. Next turn off Push Mail. To do that go to Mail Settings. Tap on Accounts, and then tap on Fetch New Data. Turn off Pushmail. Pushmail will automatically retrieve new messages as they arrive in your inbox on the server. And this uses a lot of battery. Instead of this use Fetch Mail option. Fetch means that your iPhone will regularly check with Apple's email server for new messages. You can set automatically. Your iPhone will fetch new data in the background only when on power and on Wi-Fi. Manually, your email only arrives when you open mail and it refreshes. Also you can set mails to refresh hourly, every 30 minutes, every 15 minutes. You can set any of this option and this will improve your iPhone battery life. Next turn on dark mode. To do that go to display and brightness settings. 
Tap on dark. You can also set schedule. Dark mode reduces the light emitted by device screens while maintaining the minimum color contrast ratios required for readability. This also increases battery life. Next, disable background app refresh. To do that, go to general and tap on background app refresh. To save battery life, disable background app refresh from app that you don't want them to run in the background. Background app refresh allows suspended apps to check for updates and new content while they're running in the background, and drains your iPhone battery. Next, update your iPhone. To do that, go to General and then tap in Software Update. You'll see Update here. Tap on Download and Install. A new iOS update can improve battery life. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe, like, share, and comment.